Hello again. Uh, I don't know exactly when this video is going out, but if you watched my whatever Wednesday from the 3rd, then you will know that I told everyone I got a looper pedal, and this is the first time I've ever owned one. Uh, ditto looper from TC Electronic. Uh, so, seeing as I've never actually played with one of these before, uh, I was just going to make a, a short video just kind of messing around with it and seeing what I can make. I got a camera set up to check out my my pedal board. I set all the pedals up on top of my desk. So uh, excuse excuse the mess. They're usually not set up here. Obviously, they're usually on the floor by my feet where you would put a stomp pedal. But uh, I did the best I could with what I had. So <laughs> I figured this would just be something fun to do. Plus, it gives you guys a chance to check out the, the gear I have uh, so far <laughs> and what I've been using to, to make any of the other... Uh, the short tunes, if any of you like the tones I'm getting on any of those, uh, this is the, the gear that I'm, I'm using to do it. So let's play around and see what we can do. Okay, here we go. Yeah, I changed my shirt. Mind your business. All right, let's see. Hopefully I can make something cool out of this. I do hope so. I, I put on pants for this. Let's see. I have my cheat sheet. I think you can see that there. It's a little sheet that tells me kind of what does what. One press and you're recording. So let's find uh, what's a good bass. Let's see something a little, uh, a little with a little fuzz, huh?
something i don't know <laughs> uh anyway obviously i have a lot more work to do before i i'm really ready to make anything out of this but uh i mean it's a lot of fun to play with it definitely is uh there's a lot of stuff you could do with it that i didn't even really get to uh just because i was so trying to focus on even making something but uh you can you know i, I got to like apply multiple layers but even if you like let's say you make us another uh you start a loop 
and then you put something else on top of that and on top of that and you just keep stacking on these new little parts um, but there's also ways to like go back and redo the last one you did if you're not happy with it which is really cool I mean that's a lot to do for such a little pedal I know that um, TC Electronic makes like other versions of the Ditto Looper that are more advanced and, and, and more capable so it's it blows my mind that even this one kind of the smaller one is still has so much you could do with it it's fantastic but yeah that's it for me for now maybe if I can you know get a little more in depth with the pedal if I can get a little better at using it uh, this is again this is the first time I've ever touched the thing so this was just kind of a lot of guesswork but if I could figure out how to really utilize it maybe I'll make a, a video specifically about like how to use it effectively or, or we'll see if I can uh, more likely I'll, I'll maybe find a way to make a cool little short tune out of it I'd love to do that so we'll see how that goes it would also be a lot easier to use I put it up here because I wanted to have like the filming you know and, and you could see me playing with the, the pedals and the not just the looper pedal but the knobs on the other stuff to see what I'm doing uh, but it would be a lot easier to do a lot of this if I uh, you know if, if the pedal was by my feet because it was hard to time like when to play something and then hit the, the loop to start but honestly pretty happy with it I'm pretty excited to see what I can do with it but yeah that does it uh, for me if you guys like this go ahead and subscribe uh, I got I'll have a lot more nonsense like this coming along I got more good stuff on the way like the video if you like the video whatever you want to do I'll see y'all next time keep safe out there Stay cool.